<laughs> That's right. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Captain James Luke Picard yes. of the SS Enter Guys. This is my second lieutenant, Captain <laughs> Duggar Von half. Suckdick. Duggar, Duggar Von Suckett. Duggar right, Von Suck live. me off. Group, I'm just kidding. Uh, We're live, and I am Captain James Luke Picard of the SS Enter Guys. Yes. You're watching Deep Space Nine Inches. Nine, nine thick nine inches. Thick inches. Thick ass I'm just inches. kidding. But seriously, let's talk about that for a second. Nine thick inches. I just in read my an ass. Article. I just read an article. Dug my it. face is completely. I in. read an it's article awesome. recently that told me about a man's penis shrinking post COVID. Yes. His penis. Can COVID nineteen actually shrink you? These are some articles I just read. Mm -hmm. uh, man claims penis. <laughs> Sorry, I'll stop the accent. Man claims penis shrunk. After contracting COVID. That's, this is from the New York Post. So, in case anybody out there that listens to this in the future or you're listening now. Yes. Uh, yeah, it's from the New York Post. There's another one here from Newsweek. What we know about COVID and penis size. As a man says, it shrunk his penis by an inch and one half. Uh, so, that's pretty, that's pretty intense dimensions of shrinkage right there. That's, that's pretty bad, dude. Another, another uh, article right here from InsideHook.com. Can COVID-19 actually shrink your penis? And it says here, men suffering from post-COVID shrinkage might also consider stretching the penis with... Wait, what? With a traction device called the Restore X? What in the fuck is that? Which sounds terrifying. Our daddy but, taught us not to be ashamed of our dicks, especially since they're such good size and all. Yep, that's right. That's what my daddy yeah. taught me. My daddy taught me a lot about my dick. I tell you what, when I was a boy, he used to teach me how to wash it super fast in the shower. Yeah. I'm sorry. I was going to get into like something where I had to suck my dad's cock, but I was like, I'm not, I don't want to, I don't want to besmirch my, uh, my father's name. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> By making up stories of fucking. Well, of, my dad of, fucked uh, me in my the My dad ass. fucked my ass. And now I'm fucking gay. Oh, Billy. <laughs> my dad sucked his dick. Wait. My dad sucked your dick or? Who's those? Who's dad? Maybe your dad sucked mine. I don't know. We don't have the same father, so it yeah. could be. It's not gay. That's not gay. If your dad, if it's not, if it's not your, if a man sucks your dick and he's not your dad, it's not gay. Is it gay? Next on Vice News. Tonight on Vice News, if your dad sucks your dick, is it gay? Um, it's not a tumor. <clears throat> no, it's not. Suck it, son. I'm, I'm having too much fun with the soundboard. I know you are. <laughs> the first time with the soundboard, uh, Duggar Von Haas on the Roadcaster. On the ones and twos. On the ones and twos. Breaking loose with the Roadcaster Pro. My main man, Duggar Von Haas, breaking loose with the Roadcaster Pro. As you go, yeah, yeah, you know it. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm sorry. I don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, man claims COVID-19. This is Fox News for fuck's sake, dude. This is This is amazing. I just I just heard this on another podcast, yeah. and I wanted to bring it up. Not only did Captain James Lou Picard come to me in a dream with the Deep Space Nine, and uh, uh, what was his name? Uh, oh, my. I'm George Takei. Check out the girth and length of my wang. Yes. Um, that guy. Um, I had a dream about that last night, Deep Space Nine Inches. It was creepy as shit. That's why I want to talk about that. Mm -hmm. But then I, I heard about this article, and I'm going, wait, you can your dick? That explains a lot. Because I was thinking the other day, when I was jerking off, I was in the bathroom, and I'm fucking giving it one, like the high hard one after a, a, a fucking, a fucking uh, a, a lengthy tanning yeah. session. You know what I'm saying? You want to, like, release the stress after mm -hmm. that. So you come home, you strop one down, you take a shower, you lotion back up. Jerk off. Couples, yeah, you jerk off. You know what I mean? You're jerking off. That's what I mean by stropping it down. Anyway, I was jerking off, and I'm like, dude, my penis doesn't seem to be as thick or as long as it once was. And then I'm like, wait a minute. COVID, is right? that the same thing? Yeah, I'm like, is it fucking, is it fucking, did I have, like, I've never been sick. Like, I don't get sick. Like, that's just a thing. And if I have, like, I, I don't have, I've never had symptoms. I don't know what any of that crap is. I think it's all bullshit. It's all the flu. Um, if you're healthy, you're healthy. If you're not, you're not. No, I'm just kidding. I've been sick. I've, I've been sick a couple times this year, but never any of the symptoms that they talk about on the news. But anyway, uh, I'm now realizing that I obviously I've had COVID because my penis is definitely smaller. Or they said you was hung, and they was right. No, they was wrong. They was wrong. They you did got small. They was wrong. Um, but seriously, I'm wondering: is it is it that 
it's just my imagination, and I'm either getting fatter. I'm just getting fatter. Yeah. And like it, it's like optical illusion. Like I'm looking in the mirror. Like I'm not watching myself while I'm jerking off. I'm not like, oh yeah, look at that. Mm-hmm. Oh god, yeah. Fuck yes. It. You know, but um, maybe it's the size gain thing. Maybe it's post COVID. We don't know. We don't know. Um, and we don't really, and and, 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 and and to be honest with Long you, I don't COVID. really give a shit because I don't. There's nobody. I, 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 nobody out there is rushing to fucking uh, finger to, your butt to, to jump on exactly. To jump up the ass or on the dong of the fucking master of disaster, Mad Maximilian Squeedle. And uh, so I don't really give a shit. But the thing is, is it that, is it really post-COVID penis shrinkage? Or is it like that thing when you were a kid? Like, you know, when you, like, sorry. Not not the penises were bigger when you were kids. (laughs) Jesus Christ. Penises were bigger when I was a kid. Damn it. I've been fucking, I grew up with them fucking the same size. Um no, I mean the relativistically. You know how you always look. You look at like the Snickers bar, like the regular size yeah. Snickers, and you're like, dude, this thing is fucking. What the hell is this? Like, What's wrong with this? Dude, it's like two bites. Dude, a Snickers bar is two bites, man. Imagine if a dick was two bites. You'd be fucking super what? pissed. Well, metaphorically speaking, it's, I'm not saying like, you know what I mean. Like, if your dick was a Snickers bar, imagine if it shrunk overnight, and if you went my to go. Dick shrunk yeah, you overnight. went to whip your dick out. You un. You you fucking you my took dick the wrapper, shrinks. the metaphoric wrapper off your fucking. Off your, uh, you know, snicker dick, mm-hmm. and you fucking, you know, to give it a whiff in the morning. Take a whiff, pull it out. Suck the taste my is dick. gonna move you when you pop it in your mouth. Juicy fruit, it tastes like Snickers. Juicy That's fruit, for dick. Just kidding, maybe. I don't know. Sorry. Um, no, but seriously, Juicy does fruit, COVID shrink your penis? It's for. Okay. All right. Hey. Right on. Ha-ha. <laughs> and he said, you heard it all here, ladies and gentlemen. You couldn't tell if my lips were moving because my face tell. is hidden behind the microphone. You couldn't tell if his lips were moving. That's right. Um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, everybody. Before I just thought I'd gone. drop that out there. Before we get completely taken, check us out. We're actually on Spotify, iTunes. Uh, I, to be honest with you, Duggar's in charge of all that, so he, he yeah, should I'll, know I'll, where we I, are. We're, uh, Why don't you tell people where we are for a second while I... I know so how, far we're on Spotify. I'm trying to figure out how much my dick has shrank since, and uh, since the, the pre-COVID. Oh, my God. There's another guy here. He says his dick shrunk an inch. What? And he says he's can't, and he, can't, and he can't get it up. But you're, don't worry, you though. You get nothing. Your, urologist. You lose. Oh, my God. Good day, sir. This is the sun.com. Yeah. Urologist. Yeah. You lose all right, buddy. Yeah, right? You I know. You lose now Your because COVID dick work. is real. The fucking phenomenon. I'm reading it right now. Ladies and gentlemen, this is not a fucking joke. Okay? Not funny live. The child wrote, my penis is not working. Okay, well, actually, it does work because I was playing with it earlier. But uh, I'm still not sure. Is it, like the, is it like the candy bar thing? Is it real? Is it, is it post? Is it fucking, yeah. is it, is it, I'm getting, am I getting fatter? And my penis is like the same size, but it looks like it's smaller because like, like the rest of my body is like growing around it. You know, I don't even know anymore, man. I don't yeah. even know. I'm just confused. I want to get off the topic now. Um, but you know what? Speaking of fucking huge dicks, if Kevin, imagine if Kevin Bacon... Caught uh, allegedly, he's super hung. Imagine if Kevin Bacon or like one of these porn stars caught yes. COVID and their dick like shrank and didn't work anymore. That would be the worst. That would like be your entire then career. Your dreams would never come true of right. being fucked by uh, Kevin Bacon in the ass. I know my dreams of Kevin Bacon slamming his ham against my butt cheeks. Um, who wouldn't want Kevin Bacon to press their ham? Which reminds me, yeah, I was uh, I was hanging out with some buddies of mine the other night. We went out for a couple of brew haws, a couple of ice cold Bruhanians. Yep, <laughs> that's right, Deerfield Beach style, baby. Scoping some Bettys, that kind of thing. And uh, we were talking about like you know what's you know what what's the return for Hollywood? What's the entertainment industry like? Do you do you know do you really have to suck Will Smith's dick? Um, and if you do, is he gonna vomit on you like he did on all those women that he allegedly vomited on post ejaculate? Uh, he would like ejaculate and vomit on women, apparently. Yeah. Uh huh. Um, because he was like, because he had so much sex. I don't know about that. That kind of makes him sound like he's like disgusted by having sex with women. I don't Ooh. know. But I heard he was down with fucking dudes too. So hey, mm-hmm. right on. Yeah. Um, Who is that? Will Smith, man. Oh, allegedly. Will Smith? Cool. Allegedly, I don't know. I mean, I've never met Will Smith. Um, but I can tell you what. Who I have met? I went to a party once in Hollywood, mm-hmm. and I met RuPaul. Oh, really? Yeah, he walked right past me. I saw his dick and everything. Oh, that's fantastic. Um, yeah, it was fantastic. It was envy. fantastic. I envy. Actually, I was like 19 at the time. I remember looking around. I remember looking over my shoulder. My buddy was like, hey, look at that. This is a guy's dick hanging out. Look, that. He goes, that lady's got a penis. 
my buddy goes, dude, that chick's got a dick, bro. And I look over, and I'm like, what the fuck is that? That's RuPaul. Uh, that's fucking RuPaul's dick. That's RuPaul's that big old RuPaul, fat dick. That was RuPaul. Allegedly, it was RuPaul. RuPaul's I'm going to say that right now. For legal RuPaul's big old dick. RuPaul's got a fucking... Actually, I think, he, I think, like, you know, I think he had Coke dick because... It wasn't, um, it wasn't doing too good. You know when you drink too much Coca-Cola? Yeah. And you get like a, yeah, and you get like a bloated stomach, and then like your stomach kind of out bloats your wiener, makes your dick look small. Yeah, that's kind of what happened. Um... Okay. It just kind of looked like a tube hanging out the opposite side of his asshole. Like a little, you know, thing. Anyway, penis shrunken syndrome. Uh, I can't really talk about it any more than that. Yeah. It's just too intense. Yeah. Um, but I did, I, did meet, uh, I did meet the master of mullets today. I was out getting, I was down at the, the thing getting tan. Yeah. And I was, uh, and I bumped into this dude. Mullet man. Uh, the master of mullet. King I, mullet. The king of mullets, dude. And I wanted to bow down in front of this guy. And be like, we're not worthy kind of thing. You know what I mean? Like, you know, oh, I'm not worthy. Wayne's world. We're not worthy. We're not worthy. Um, yes. But I didn't want to fuck the guy off. And he like, but we looked, mm-hmm. we locked eyes at, at this at one point, And it was like, I almost heard the roar of, of like a tiger or maybe it was like a dragon or some ancient fucking like mythic beast. I was like, whoa, dude. Like it was like that. It was like, you ever see that scene in the Step Brothers? Yeah. Where they first meet and they come face to face and he's like, you know, call me dragon. Yeah. And the other guy's like, yeah, it was like that. <laughs> pretty much. But yeah, I just kept walking, though, out the door, obviously. I didn't stop and, like, yeah, we didn't of. make contact. But Oh, hey, you know, sometimes you get to meet your heroes. And sometimes they don't disappoint you. I know. And meeting the master of the mullet. The mullet man. Almost convinced me to go home and shave my head into a mullet. And I was like, dude. To become a mullet yourself. You can't do that. I'm, 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 I'm in the process of, of starting my fake gay OnlyFans channel. I was going to tell people about this to to excite the um, the filthy old dirty gay bastard community, mm-hmm. which that's not an insult by the way. That's actually the name of a community, the old filthy fat gay bastard community. Yeah, I know. Um, and it's basically just a bunch a of member. fucking creepy old dudes. Yeah, we're, we're members and. Yeah. Uh, you don't have to be a homosexual to join it. It's actually about being. It's it, it's actually nothing. It's nothing against. It's not about gay. It's nothing against gay people. Like you can be gay and join the group. You can, um, but, you but it's, it's, it's all about just getting together and being happy, and also and being sucking fat. dick and, yeah, and, sucking and, and getting dicks. fucked. Yeah, and fucking. Um, but assholes. seriously, <laughs> we're not members of that community. Yeah. But if we were, though, imagine we'd be like the head of the town, dude. All those old dudes just fucking slamming. Oh god, just slamming it in the in the slamming in the jam, slamming, slamming post, the jammer, dude. Slamming, slamming the it. jammer. Boom, 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 you're just not that cool. All right. Get your hand off my penis. Can you imagine? Well, who would you really, who would you rather want to get? Listen, if you had to go. Yeah. If here's I had to the go conversation. Where? Here's the conversation, dude. Yes. Here's the conversation. You're in fucking, you get down to Hollywood, right? Everything yeah. is going fucking great. You're, you're down there. You go down, you meet an agent. They see you. They're like, oh, well, we'll get shots. We'll do all this stuff. Da, 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 da. You get hooked up. They bring you into this, you know, this deal. And you've already. I think somebody just rode something down to the ground. I think someone just rode something down too. I have no idea what the hell that was. Well, cats. Whatever. Life of having cats. We just like a massive crash in the background. It's like, okay, cats. Um, Automobile. That too. Yeah. Um, dude, you Our gotta cats love are the dong. You gotta love dong. the donger, man. Yeah. Our cats are basically dong. You gotta love the dong. But um, here's the deal. You're in Hollywood. Everything's great. You are, you, you've got you've gotten a couple of things. Some callbacks, blah, 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 blah. They bring you to this party, right? I mean, when mm-hmm. I say they, I mean the the dudes. You know what I'm saying? The dudes. You know what I mean? The Luminatus! Yeah, those guys. Yeah. And they go, listen, you want to fucking get a movie deal. You want to be in the deal. You want to fucking have the, the, the fucking shots of yes. fucking foreskin juice in your face to keep your wrinkles under fucking, you know, whatever. You want to get the fucking, uh, you want to get the, uh, what was her name, dude? Sandra it Bullock. Rubs lotion on its skin. It does this whenever it's told. Sandra Bullock, basically. Yeah. Get the lotion, um, bro. Yeah, if you want to get Sandra Bullock, you do that. But you got to get fucked by somebody in Hollywood, right? And, yeah. they, and like, who's it going to be? Like, you can choose. 
You get to choose, and it can't be, and I know what you're thinking. Oh, well, that's easy. Jennifer Aniston. Nope. No way, buddy. No way. It, go, it comes down to this. Kevin Bacon. Yeah. Jack Nicholson. And we're talking about the, mm-hmm. like, you know, Al Pacino. You know what I'm saying? Imagine how that would be. Like, would you, would you go with a, would you go with, like, a Leonardo DiCaprio? You know what I'm saying? And he's going to make, like, it's, it's going to be brutal, dude. It's going to be fucking brutal. And I'm not talking about, like, fucking hole slamming. I'm talking about, like, he's going to want to make love to your butt, dude. Yeah, probably. Like, it's going to be probably tender fuck you at do. times. It will be tender. It will be tender. And by by tender, I mean you're not going to be able to shit right for a week by the time they're done. Because this is not just like, like, they tell you it's one dude. But the next thing you know, it's fucking like 13 fucking actors like some of, like one of the guys from that uh, the 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 uh, Superman TV series yeah. that he shows yeah. up he's fucking jerking off he's got his camera and he's like I'm directing this thing shut up and get fucked you're like oh my god wait a minute what a dude that looked he, he looked like Mark Wahlberg we're not sure if he was or not he's in the room he's fucking getting down he doesn't want to fuck you though he's like I just want to jerk off and come to this whole scene because well like some actors are like that you know what I mean they'll they'll they want to get down. But they, they're like, mm, I've got to watch my semen. So basically, they'll jerk off into like you know their own hand or into a condom, and then they'll pour hot sauce on it and then shove it up their own ass or just put it in their pocket and save it for later. But they always leave with it. You know what I'm saying? They never like yeah. they never leave semen unattended. I'm not. I mean, I'm guessing that's because a lot of people in Hollywood are scared that someone's going to take the seed and you know try to make a butt baby with it or something. Try like to that. fuck their butts with it. Um, something like that. But imagine going to Hollywood and they do that, dude. What and do you getting do? Getting seated? Do you take that fucking? I mean, Tom Hanks is in the room, you know, and he's like, he's got like this, la- like this thin layer of like, like Vaseline all over his entire body. He's all wearing over his cowboy asshole? boots and a fucking matching hat, and he's he's talking in the voice from uh, Toy Story. He's being Woody. He's talking as Woody from Toy Story. Yeah, it's intense, bro. I- Deep intense. <clears throat> It's really intense. Kind of like when you get your asshole spread. I mean, right towards the end of the night, like it's early morning, like a guy, you don't even realize this. Like that's when you're, you're practically numb from the waist down at this point. Like they've already busted it, busted you up. I mean, like Kevin Hart's been there for sure. And you know, if that's that, if that's the case, the rocks there, uh, Tyler Perry, you know, whatever. And you might even get an Anderson Cooper or Steve Carell in the room. You never know with these types. Anderson Cooper for sure, um, and that's like and that's like not that bad. No, I mean, God rest his soul, bad. Louis Anderson. Imagine that. Imagine <laughs> having Louis. An- imagine having to. They're like, actually, none of those actors are available, Duggar. You're gonna Dude, have fucking to meatloaf and you're Louis gonna Anderson have to suck to back, meatloaf bro. and and fucking Louis Anderson. <laughs> Like the same I'm fucking I'm just kidding. Day. They both died, dude. That's kind of sad. Yeah, apparently Louis Anderson was uh, cancer. Sucking off meatloaf. That's what cock. they're saying now. They're saying it was cancer. Oh, my so, God. You know, oh, my God. Whatever that, that is, means. That is shitty. Cancer could be anything, dude. It means you got a booster shot last week. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Now we're going to be censored. Now we're going to get censored for talking shit. Whatever. I don't give a fuck. About the COVID. There's a lot of that Asian food going around. Mm-hmm. A lot of jungle fever, too, but not the neighborhood. Uh, unfortunately, I, I, you know, the, the child, the, the uh, yeah, the well, child, the brother nature, the child, the brother nature from cosmic spooge is down with the brown. I, well, oh, hell I, yeah, dude. Which means, you know, hey, I've dated black chicks. All, yeah, so have I. So have oh, yeah. I, quite a few, quite a few, quite a few. Quite a and few. I've been, and, and and now, see, nowadays, see, like that used to be, like that was like cliche back in the day when I was like back, like I was like, dude, I don't want to be judged by like I got, I got treated like shit by the chicks by by. By like black women's families. Oh hell yeah, dude! Until They're they found so out like I came from a good family. Until like until they found out I came from a good family, and it was like, oh, well, this white guy's all right then. Yeah. But you still better not be fucking my daughter, period. And if you are, you better wear a condom because we don't want no. And I got told this straight up that that by one white because I was dating this one girl in Santa Cruz. Yeah. Her dad straight up told me he did not want uh, mixed a half, race. Like yeah, he half, didn't want any mixed. I don't race want any kids. halfy kids. Fucking run around my no, property. Um, she had a she had a child from a previous marriage. I've got a cat on um, my chair. And that dude was black, but like he blatantly told me he did not want me to. There's a cat on um, camera now. Yeah, is there? Yep. Well, Inside. there's a cat on camera. Oh my god, he's trying to jump up on the fucking screen. <laughs> yeah, he is. Basil, you stupid motherfucker. Yeah, it's pretty. He's like, I can jump up there. That's a shelf. Cats and green screens. Oh, great. There's another one. Wow, what's happening? Yeah, right they're now? getting. Yeah, there we go. Goodbye. Thank and you. Goodbye. Thank you. 
Thanks for showing up and have a good night. Don't forget bye. to. Bye bye. Bye. Yeah. Bye bye. Anyway, Tom Cruise, you're in a Scientology movie. You're going to get Mission Impossible you're sucking 7 his and 8 delayed. Wait. They're filming them back to back? Well, they'd have to because he's getting older now. How old is Tom Cruise? Like 90? Like 90. Yeah. 95. But all that fucking fresh Hollywood cum, dude, that keeps you alive. See, he's probably, they would probably use, they would probably like just be like, look, dude, just jerk off into this fucking, into this uh, receptacle, you know, like 10 yeah. or 15 times. And then they fucking jerk like clone your jizz. Dude. And then Tom, and, like, they're like, oh, we need a certain type of jizz for Tom Cruise. He only likes a certain kind. So you have to have a specific diet. Like, that's why they make all these Hollywood types go on diets. They mm -hmm. take their, like, that's what it is. Like, the guy who's in uh, Superman, what was his name? Henry Cavill. In order for him to get, and I, I, I allegedly, this is from third fucking party deals, but I've heard this all before. They fucking make them fucking store up their jizz. Like, it's called semen retention. And oh, allegedly, saving your nut? Yeah, yeah. they do that. Yeah. Allegedly, they make them save your It makes your, your testosterone get higher, yeah. apparently. Yeah, and what they do, no, well, no, it's not for that, though. It may have that also as train. a... It may also be that, but what they're doing is these producers are fucking harvesting their spooge after. And sticking it up their assholes. No, they fucking give it to other high-up actors like Tom Cruise. Fucking really? Mel... Well, Mel Gibson got kicked out of the gang, but, I mean, you know, Tom Cruise and fucking, you know... Yeah. Tom Cruise. I think basically. you're something, bro. Tom Cruise is probably the only one who still gets all the semen. You're deep into it. We're, we're, Where's all the semen coming going from? from? Going to. Going to. Going um, from. There's going probably to. a select group of Hollywood actors that do, yeah. that uh, they prey on, you know, other actors. It's like I was just saying. If you want to get into Hollywood, you got to suck that dick. And they're, I'm not, and if you're into that, that's great. And if you want to suck sorry, the dick. Dave. I'm afraid I can't do that. Yeah, exactly. I See, that's what I'm saying. I can't go I can't there. Do that. I can't that's do why that. I started my own Hollywood right here in Florida. And if you want to join it, you have to suck my dick. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. You have to suck Mad Maximilian's dick if you want to join my Hollywood, motherfucker. We're making a movie. It's called The Sounds of Fucking Butt Thunder, Volumes 1 through 4, where I basically plunder the living daylights out of a shitload of college girls. And uh, it's kind of like girl, Girls Gone Wild, but yeah. there's anal sex and fucking there's no condoms. No condoms. Um, it's kind of a, it, it's, well, a lot of the sponsors and producers are Catholic. They don't like condoms. Um, yeah, so we're not going to be wearing any of those. Um, so don't wear a condom while you're butt fucking. I was going to say me, don't, but don't wear a condom while you're butt fucking a dude. Yeah, don't wear condoms. Where that's you're how you get them. AIDS. That's how you get AIDS. You can only catch AIDS by wearing a condom, ladies and gentlemen. It's the, uh, no, by not wearing. Usually, by, when you don't wear a condom, you get AIDS from doing anal sex. Oh shit! It's, it's that's how you get the anal sex AIDS. That's how you get the, that's, how that's how you get how you, the I, asshole I that's how you got asshole warts. And that's how you get that's how you get the AIDS. You get warts on your asshole from gay sex. Um allegedly Tom Cruise taught me that. Really? Yeah, on the set of uh Mission Impossible 5. Yeah. He's a very tender, very tender, very loving man. Yeah. Um dude, he was married to a couple of hot chicks, wasn't he? Decent. Dude, decent. Who, who decent. The fuck was decent. Tom Cruise decent. You know what I mean? Tom Cruise. We should fucking... We need to find that out, dude. Um, Tom Cruise, man. I, I tell you right now. Why don't you look it up? I'm going to look it up, dude. I know Nicole, You've I know got Nicole the power. Kidman. He was You've married, got the power. I know, I know he was married to Nicole Kidman. At one point. And I, yeah, I'm I telling so. you right now. She or at least is fuck the shit out of her. smoking hot, dude. Let me tell you something about the Hollywood foreskin and, and jism. You you think I'm fucking Pure joking skin. around. You want to you think I'm joking around. If we, if we could only bring up a picture of Nicole Kidman right now. Mm, yeah, I'll do dude, that. Dude, she looks like she's in her fucking 20s. Okay, maybe not her 20s, but like 30s. No, she doesn't look that good anymore. Dude, she does look good. No, she really does. Oh, she my really God. Doesn't. I would love to fucking... Uh, dude, I would let her sit on my face let's night see. and day. Mimi Rogers, what does no, she look No, she's like? looking oh. kind of ghastly now. Oh, fuck. Yeah, she's... Um. Yeah, don't yeah. look up Mimi Rogers. Don't look up Mimi Rogers. I don't want to show you Katie Nicole Holmes, Kidman baby. Either, Katie the... Holmes, dude. Tom hey. Cruise was up in there. Oh my god, she's so eh, hot. Not, not dude, terrible. she's fucking hot. Hold she's on. hot. Let me, let me put it over here on the screen for. Uh, like, there's certain women out there rip, rip. that you would that, that you would do dirty stuff with. She's one of them. And the thing is, look at that way she look how she's dressed. She's like she's she's one. She's like oh, dude. 
that practically says and she's got my name on her fucking on her on her left tit, dude. Yeah, tattooed on her left tit. Um, Does she know? Yeah, she just like honestly, I've had to change my name and, and phone and address like fucking. I don't even want to talk about a it. It's, it's disgusting. But she's super hot in bed and uh, allegedly, and she fucking loves it when you lick her asshole. She's super into having her butthole licked, and that's kind of hot too for an older woman. And if you think about it, I mean, like God knows how old she really is, but um, I mean. They w- it doesn't even say on Wikipedia. It's like, well, we're not going to tell you how old she is. It doesn't say it at all. Really? It says she was born in 1967. I'm Jesus no good at math. Then do fucking. Oh, she's 54. Jesus fucking Christ. She was really born in Hawaii. Who? Nicole Kidman was not born in Hawaii. And she is not 54 years old. Is she really? Yeah, I think so. Oh, my God. Citizenship is United States and Hollywood? Yeah. Fuck, dude. That's even oh, hotter ooh. than I want. That's even hotter than I thought. Yeah, I got to like, destroy this one. Microphone shit is whoa. You got to get used to that microphone, motherfucker. Um, he was married to Mimi Rogers, dude. Mimi Rogers wasn't she in? Um, uh, let's. Check oh it no, out. that's not the same. Oh, is it? No, it's not the same chick, dude. Who the fuck is this ugly, fucking sack of ass? She was in Austin <laughs> Powers. <laughs> Two and a half men. She she's was in Austin Powers. Yeah, all right. Well, we're not even going to give her shit. She has she's no the older. Now. She's the not older mother. She's Austin Powers' older mother. Or the, the, the girlfriend, Vanessa, whatever oh, her face was. Oh, he was, was into mother. fucking banging old bitches? <sighs> oh, that he old. did. No, because he's, he, no, he's old as fuck, bro. Oh, is he? No, yeah. dude. He's ancient. Tom Cruise dude. is a fucking vampire from the fucking ninth century. Oh, I'm century. telling you. You look at a picture of Tom Cruise, bro. That guy is fucking, he's got some juice. That's a lot of foreskin right there. Yeah, that's a lot of, the, dude, they inject foreskin into people. Who is that? That's Mimi Rogers when she, that's her and Tom Cruise together. Oh, dude, she was over 10, she's like 10 years older than him, too. She was fucking, Probably. she was taking him for a ride. You know what I'm saying? She was like, I'm going to rub my hairy fucking bush on your face, young stud. Jesus Christ. I'm going to fucking, I'm going to fucking, I want you to fucking... Tell me what my fucking pussy musk smells like. Flart. <laughs> Back then, it was like that because you know, they fucking such like Bush was a thing, like Bush League. That yeah. was a real thing. Like a lot of people joke about that, but can you imagine how thick her Bush was? Look at that. No, I don't want to. I do. I don't want to imagine. I want to talk about it. Tom Cruise. Let's talk about that for a second. Fuck Mimi Rogers. She's ugly as shit now. But Nicole Kidman. You ever seen a grown man naked? Exactly. That's what Mimi Rogers looks like right now. A fucking old man's balls. A grown man naked? <clears throat> she looks like some old man's yeah. dick. Uh. Um, imagine what fucking... Can you imagine what Al Pacino's dick looks like? I'm not trying to fuck you up right now. I know I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm, I'm actually cooking dinner tonight for a bunch of people. Having some friends over. And I'm sitting here talking about <laughs> Al Pacino's dick. It's, it looks like sizzling bacon. Al, Al, <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Hold on a second. Al Pacino's dick... Looks I bet like, it's, dude, I bet yeah, you it's, it's just the pustules and, and shit are no, 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 constantly no, no. bursting. No, no, it's not like that. He's got like dandruff cock, dude. Like the skin on his That's dick is dry. flaky. Dry. But it's like also greasy in between the weird like old man dick folds. Mm. It's fucking burly, dude. And like every now and then he's got, he's got an assistant that like stretches the skin out. Yeah. And has to fucking like use sand, like that mild sand. Like the, what's that Mr. Clean scrubby brush they sell at the store, dude? The magic eraser? Clean? Yeah, the magic eraser. She's one of like those. Magic eraser, the tip of his cock. She's like, oh, I gotta fucking buff this fucking helmet out, dude. He's got like dry cock skin. No, helmet. I don't want to. He's got about dry that. helmetitis. I don't want to think about that. Um, I don't want to think yeah. about that. I don't want to think about that. <coughs> <laughs> I really don't want to fucking think about that, dude. Dude, all the movies Tom Cruise was in. If you think about the names of the movies, they could all be gay pornos. Top all right, gun. Check it out. Top, Top gun. gun. Top Gun. Two men enter. Maverick Wait. wants to fuck this dude's ass. A guy named Goose. Maverick, the story of a man named Goose who fucked... Wait. Maverick, fucking ass. Maverick. The st- Wait. Top Sucking gun. dick. Top, <laughs> Top Gun, the story Top of Maverick. He fucked, in, he fucked Goose to death and then blamed it on... And then stuffed him in the back of an airplane and then <laughs> faked a crash over the Pacific. He's like, blamed oh it on the God. Chinese. I broke his neck fucking his ass. I'm Maverick, and I killed my best friend, Goose, fucking him. But it's okay, because I stuffed his corpse in a fucking jet fighter and flew it over the Pacific. And now I'm a fucking hero. I'm going to go back to having sex with... Oh, by the way, mm. Tom Cruise. Who is the chick who was in um, Top Gun? I'm going to look Top Gun up really quick. Oh, um... Up- Kelly, McG- Ke- Kelly McGillis? Oh, my God. 
She looks like a fucking ball sack. Yeah, I know. She like, looks like she's few, 900 years like, old. I feel bad for her. She looks bad, dude. Yeah, she so looks bad. bad. You look at her and you so look at Tom Cruise bad. and you just go, in that movie, it was He's like... He's a vampire. Yeah, I, I jerked off to like like thinking about like having her sneak in and like... Mm-hmm. She's like, oh, I know you're only 18, but I want to fucking put my mouth on your fucking manliness. And I'm like, oh, Kelly McGillis, thank you. Oh, God, yes. And she's old as fuck. Now I look at that, and I tried to go back to beat some dick the other day. You know, you like, I like, I call it like time, I, I call it fucking time stroking, dude. Yeah. Where you basically go back and you look up pictures of like, you know, hot chicks from the 60s, 70s, mm-hmm. and 80s, and you just burn one down. Well, the second I typed in that, it brought, I, I thought it was on the wrong page. I'm like, oh, who the fuck, who's, who the fuck is, it? who the fuck is Granny Gooch here, dude? What the fuck is this shit, dude? And, and I you mean, find out gr- it was her? When I say Granny Gooch, I mean fucking Gooch. This one, dude. Dude, how did you feel when you found out? Was it something like this? <laughs> it was. It was, brother. Oh my god. It was sad. Very, very sad, dude. And yeah, uh, really fucking sad. Yeah. Kelly McGillis, we fucking salute you. But honestly, no. No. Um, but I was gonna well, go into. Katie let me go Holmes. get the Kelly McGillis picture up. I'll yeah, we should bring up a picture of Kelly McGillis because I want to show a picture of what Katie Holmes looked like. Uh, looks like now as well. Oh, Katie Holmes. Oh God. Katie Holmes, by the way. Holy uh, shit! If you're out there and you're listening. Oh my God. Anyway, Tom won't mind, dude. He doesn't give a fuck. He's probably give me his. He'd probably be like, if you let me watch, I'll fucking. Oh my God, dude. Oh my God. Oh Lord. my God. She shares the birthday as somebody else I know. Well, the date. December 18th. Kelly McGill is here. Wow, she's the same that's age when, as That's her young. Oh, my God, dude. This is her in Top up, Gun, right? Dude, Kel- stroke material right there. Beat down. Dude, you could strop for hours. The scene where they're about to get down, just p- picture yourself. Oh, my God. That's worse than the one. That's worse than the one I saw. Yeah, I know, Look, right? I'm not trying to fucking attack with, don't make this. Don't. I know what's going to happen. I'm going to get a bunch of fucking people going. He oh, hates women. He's he misogynist. hates women. He's a fucking. Oh, she's still beautiful. I'm sure she's a lovely fucking person. I'm sure she is. Mm-hmm. Okay. And I'm sure she doesn't fuck kids or eat them. And that's probably why she looks like that. Yeah. And God well, bless her for being. And I even said that. dude. Hey, we take our hats off. To, we salute you here. Mm. And not funny. We fucking salute you, lady. But what I want to drop that. What, the truth bomb here is this. Go to yeah. Katie Holmes. Imagine that. Like, you're to fucking... Up, upgrade, that right? That upgrade. Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, with two Gs. You with two Gs. For, for a double dose, double of, dose of, pimping. of pimping. Yeah. Katie Holmes. Katie fucking Holmes, baby. Like, major yeah. upgrade. December 18th, 1978. She's 43. She's okay, from Toledo, see. Ohio. An all-American girl, dude. Yes. Years active, 97 to present. And she was only married to one dude, Tom Cruise. They had one kid together, Siri, I believe. They named it after the uh, Apple iPhone thing, which I always thought was kind of weird. Why the fuck would you name your kid after the iPhone or the app, the Siri? Is the Siri the Amazon thing? I had to get him when, when she was with him. Yep, there we go. Boop. Wow, look at that. He still looks good. He still looks like that. Whoa, there we go. That's what's creepy. Wow, I know, yeah. Look and, that, at that. Look, and, and then she was young. Yeah, she was fucking sp- Banking. I think he's like in like his. How old is Tom Cruise? Goodness now? gracious! For real? That how, is, for real? That I think is they, they keep lying. Absolutely delicious. She looks absolutely fucking uh, divine. Yeah, uh, you can't knock that. She's a a, a very rare specimen. A beautiful he's woman. Sixty years talented old. Talented actress. This year. Uh, and he was did born. I just say he that? was born on July third. Who was bullshit? Who Tom Cruise? What was born on July third? 1962. He's 59. Really? Yeah, supposedly. 59 years, dude. Yeah. What do we, how low do his balls hang? And does he get... Does, do you think he gets that one... Do you think they give, like, scrotal tightening surgery? To, like, they do, like, the whole deal, right? Yeah. Like, I'm if sure. you're going to get your... If you're if you're in Hollywood, you want the whole... You don't I wanna, want the whole Like, deal. imagine... You're like, yeah, of course. I want the whole package when I get the... Dude, dude, you want to do me up? Do me the fuck up, dude. I don't need it now, obviously. But I'm saying, like, when I'm fucking turning into Geezer Butler... I want some fucking scrotal tightening. I want my asshole fucking touched up, dude. You know what I'm saying? Anal fucking. I don't want it fucking hanging out the. I don't want it hanging out the back like a tail. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I mean, that's just not gonna happen. The what? 
Jesus Christ. Sucking and fucking. Sucking and fucking, dude. Yeah. If you're going to get if you're going to have to go through all that, then you want to get done up. You know what I'm saying? I mean, if you get like a face you know, your whole body's redone, mm-hmm. right? And yeah. you're in like you got like a personal trainer and you're busting loose, and then you fucking some hot chick's like, "Oh my god, I've been a fan of yours forever. It's been my fucking bucket list to have you drop your balls on my face." To suck and fuck. And then you yeah, oh, that too maybe after the ball dropping. Yeah. But she's like, "I just drop your balls on my face first. I love a t- I love a tight scrotum fucking slapping my chin." And you're like, "Oh, I've got a tight scrotum, baby. I'm going to drop some f- serious fucking And then plot sack. twist. It's a Pl- man, baby. <laughs> plot twist. It's a man, baby. She's got a she's got a cock bigger than yours, darling, and she's stropping the hell out of it. Yeah. Imagine that. Stroking. You're about to come, right? You look down, and all of a sudden she just sprays one right up your leg, dude. You know what Some Duggar says? Some of it says? gets on your balls. You're like, oh, my God. Oh, you know what God. Duggar says in a moment like that? You just fucking. It's showtime. Exactly. It's showtime. That's, what, that's when you just crock your head back, dude, and you just unleash the most ungodly fucking floodgates of semen down yeah. that fucking tranny's gullet. And you go, that's What's for America. Hot stuff. Yeah, or that. You go, that's for America. That fucking thick, frothy load for my cis cock. White cis male cock. Yeah. What does cis mean anyway? What does that even mean? Well, it's they stole. I think it's like a cis term gender? that's stolen from like chemistry. Because then there's like there's like cis, and then it's like Latin for like left and right. How about these people who are just a bunch of fucking idiots? Yeah. But um bump, but um bump. Sorry. Um. Yeah. I mean, look, you, man. The movies. Yeah. If you if you have to. If I have to. If you have to, brother. You know what I'm saying? America. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Everyone's now trans, so go fuck yourself. America. If you don't want to be gay, you'll have to jerk your own dick today. Hell yeah. America, fuck yeah. We're turning your kids into trannies. Sorry. Um, <clears throat> but seriously, I'm sorry. Um, this leads me into the um, the fake gay OnlyFans thing I was talking about earlier. We should start a fake gay. We only should. Fans. I said that the other day. I was like, dude, I should do a thing where I shave my fucking just body. green screen each other into like right? weird gay positions. Yeah, and then we like, yeah, obviously we don't. We like, I would film in a separate room on my own. I, I would take that footage, and then I would then you would go and film in a room that is exactly done exactly the same, right? Like green screen it. Like people can right. tell it's like really poorly green. Here's what I do. I fucking film myself from a fucking, fucking right yet no. Ew! Ew! Fuck no, brother! Fuck no! You just fucking jerk off in front of the fucking camera. No one wants to see that shit. Why not? That's fucking Dragon Lord style, dude. Yeah. That's like fucking. Deep. You're gonna let some dude fuck you on camera? <laughs> no, brother Duggar. Please don't. Just I'm gonna pretend that I didn't hear that. <laughs> I'm gonna pretend that I didn't hear that. Oh, sexy girlfriend. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and we're changing the topic. That's mm. right. Let me talk about this. What about the Betty White fucking sex party, dude, that I got invited to? Hell Want to yeah. talk about that? Sure. Want to talk about Betty White's fucking wrinkly old yeah, fucking... She died before the sex party could happen, She died she? before the 100th fuck orgy, dude. The fuck... The she, was gonna be, she was going to be transformed. She, no, the thing is, everybody thinks that she, Betty White died. Bring up, prop up a picture of Betty White Hold for me. Let me. Everybody thinks that oh, Betty White me. died. And... uh and to be honest, a Betty part of Veit? a part of her did a part of her in the eyes of the American and the world public, the world stage, ladies and gentlemen, because what happens is when you're part of this, like like the rare elite, right? Or you've been like, and like here's the thing, some of these actors and Hollywood types are actually embroiled into this fucking deal because what like when you're when you're in the elite, dude, what would you what would you do if you're in the elite? You'd fuck famous people, dude. Yeah. You would, and Betty That's White what you're supposed to do, right? You're supposed to fuck famous people. Betty White was a sought after fucking prize back in the day. Mm. And she was well known. Well, and this is a true story. She was known for sucking fucking cock, dude. She was known for gobbling goad. Yeah. She could take a fucking schlong like it was nobody's business and fucking completely just drain Slash milk slash work the fucking you know the whole deal shaft balls yeah, just suck suck the shit out of your cock. Just I she mean, just... actually I was told this. There's a maneuver called the pelican. 
It's where the woman can go so deep down on the on the shaft of your fucking uh-huh. engulfing, enveloping the entire slong in her gullet, and she can also put fit the balls in there simultaneously, whilst tonguing the taint and fucking anus, dude. Yeah, no shit. Now you know, that she is a champion sucking. move. Betty White perfected this move, right? Mm-hmm. Passed the skill down to others in Hollywood. And that, listen, I know that people don't want to hear this. There was such a thing, as, it was called D, uh, uh, DRR. And it went, all, the, all the actors, male and female, would write that on their photograph, their head thing, and they would usually, you know, toss them in the directors. And it stood for Director Reserves Rights. In other words, put me in your film, and I will completely spread and fucking... Uh, 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 <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And that's what's going to happen. at whatever, whatever you want. Face, back, uh, all that. It doesn't matter. You, you can do anything you want to me, baby. That's what DRR is. Director Reserves Rights. And I got friends, too. You know what I'm saying? I'm the director now. But I got a bunch of... I'm not... In, I'm not... I'm gay. But I got a bunch of homeboys here that are producers. And uh, they all want to take turns getting sucked by the famous fucking, you know, <clears throat> Duggar Von Haas. Or, uh, you know, a.k.a. Betty White. You know, if we're going metaphorical, we're going to go down that road. Anyway, Betty White was famous for that. She, would, she was well-known for giving amazing... Ha- no, no. I'm sorry. That was Nancy Reagan. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I fucked yeah. up. Nancy Reagan, the former uh, first lady. And I'm not making this up. I'm being fucking dead serious. Yeah. She knew. that's a, How do you think she hooked old Ronnie? How do you think she hooked old Ronald, brother? <laughs> Let me tell you something right now. Women have the ultimate power over men. Do that's they? the thing. Oh, yeah. If, you oh, can, yeah. if they can harness the power of the fucking, of the shaft and balls, then the man is fucking, the man is turned into a fucking completely fucking you know, shapeless and shiftless form that women can mold and manipulate to their own fucking devising. Can they? Yeah, but it only works with, from a certain age group. They have to be like 18 to like, you know, 25. If they get older than that, it's just like, yeah, okay. I mean, unless they're extremely skilled, like Betty White, she took this skill, she took the, the level of oral copulation to a, a, a whole new game. Like, I'm talking... Levels beyond anything that I can I can get into right now. I mean, I I, I just I told you about the pelican. If yes. that's not enough, I don't know what is. But uh, Betty White, Gars. I mean, look at that face, gargling. You telling me right now if she if if, if Betty White come. Here's the thing, she's not dead. She's alive because she's okay? yeah she's here gargling she, our cum. No, she's not here. But she went back to being a young person again. They fucking they they all the semen that fucking they they they, har- they harvest the Hollywood elite fucking demonologists right. Yeah. Well, actually, they're they, not. Uh, no, no, no. They, they, they it don't? wasn't the demonologist uh, that, that, that saved Betty White. It was the D's. D's nuts. D's nuts. Ha <laughs> ha. D's nuts. Got yeah. him. Sorry. Um, I love this new soundboard, Roadcaster Pro. Ro- I'm not even. I'm, we're not. Job, spo- right? I'm not sponsored by Roadcaster. Roadcaster Pro. We're it's just buying bo- dumb shit it's to do dumb shit. Boy. We're dumb as fuck. <laughs> And we like spending money on dumb shit. It's your fucking boy, Red Shadow Legends. Road, um, Roadcaster Shadow Legends. Road. Dude, we're not. Good. <laughs> we're not good at those. Uh, that was t- definitely two of the most piss poor examples of Scottish accents I've ever heard. Just leading off with mine, I'm not just knocking you. I'm saying those were both extremely horrid. Um, and yeah. we should and we should know this. And <laughs> yeah, that too. We should feel bad about it. Having said that, everybody needs to go over and check out. Not not scunny. Not not scunny. Not funny live. We're on Spotify. We're on iTunes. We're on a bunch of shit. Just go on all the platforms you can. Type in not funny live. Uh, not funny live on YouTube. And don't forget to go to buymeacoffee.com forward slash not funny live to donate to the master himself, Mad Maximilian Squeedle, the child of Brother Nature. And, of course, Duggar Von Haas, Dr. Guns, a.k.a. the Master of Disaster. Keep the change, you filthy animal. Exactly. Give us some fucking money. Honestly, it won't fucking kill you to shell out and drop a couple of coins at buymeacoffee.com forward slash not funny. Yeah, just, you know. Bit of live, money. not funny live. Give me money. Uh, give us money. Anyway, back to the comedy. Boop, 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 boop. Um, semen retention. 
Take a one. <laughs> anyway, the, the the fake gay OnlyFans was a great idea. Can you imagine if it just blew up overnight? We're like, that would be great. We're editing fucking. It's like we call it. Uh, my idea was to call it father son jerk off session, where I pretend to be his dad or like vice versa, like you know, or like we call it like like bear daddy because yeah. he's like a big dude and I'm like a skinny guy, like bear daddy twink master, and like we're in this. We're not in the same. We're not in the same room at the same time, right? Or even the same rooms. They're just done up the same, and we're jerking off, right? And then okay, every now and then, I'll look over to the right, left or the right, whatever side of the camera's going to be on, and I'll just be like, mm, oh, 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 Billy. You know what I'm saying? And then when we edit the videos together, it looks like he's in the same room, and I'm looking over at him jerking off going, oh, hey, mm, need hey, help with that? What's up? My daddy taught us how to do it with our fucking assholes. Yeah. Here, oh, and then he's like, nah. And then, like, and then when he's filming... We'll have to get a clip of him going, nah, I don't do brown. <laughs> and then fucking, uh, you know, or I, I'm strictly I, I'm strictly mouth only. Uh, but not today. I've got an ulcer. And then I'm like, oh, okay. And then like a thing goes. And then we have like a little like, this video is sponsored by AstraZeneca. The disease for, if you have herpes and you have an outbreak on the inside or outside of your asshole, don't have anal Big sex. Big Tarvey. Big Tarvey. CNN, brought to you by you watch, AIDS medication. Yeah, CNN, brought to you by every fucking brand of AIDS medication. Da 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 CNN's got AIDS. Um, they need if you it watch all for CNN, Don you're a fucking asshole. retard. Um, if you listen to any news media, you're a fucking asshole. Yeah. Um, sorry. Don't follow this channel. Just as bad. Go fuck yourself. Exactly. Um, did I say about the fucking weird pedophile who fucking verbally accosted me at the, at the bar the other day? Yes, he did. Yeah, I was Pedophile the, who fucked you in the ass. No, he didn't. He started out, he goes, you know... He I, thought he, you he, were a child. He recognized my face from a poster. You're a very young-looking man. Yes, he was like, I recognize your face from the side of a milk carton that I used to masturbate to in 1943. Yeah. I was like, oh, my God. Adolf? Oh, uh, no. Uh, my name... Uh, my name is... Um, I'm like, oh, my God. Nine, 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 Adolf Hitler had a sex change, yeah. used the Hollywood semen technique, reversed his age. He's now... Oh, our cats are awesome. No, they're just playing with shit constantly. Reversed, exactly. Reversed his age, and now he's fucking living as a woman named fucking Helga von fucking Spugenheim. <laughs> Grown adult male roommate. In Boca Raton, Florida. Dun, 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 dun. Hitler's gay. Um, that's another... Nine, uh, nine, 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 nine. He probably was, though, let's be probably. honest. Probably. He probably sucked a lot of um, dick. Hitler probably sucked a lot. A lot of cock. And we're going to get bitched out. Everyone's going to go. He probably gerbled oh, gerbils. Hitler wasn't gay, you fucking. Dude, he you gobbled fucking, gerbils. He gobbled the gerbs, dude. Yeah. Goblin gerbs. Goblin gerbils. He fucking Starring gave the Hitler. helmet to fucking, you know. Hitler von Hitler. Yeah. Stein. Helmet to the to his his fucking Helmut. Why do they just call him Hitler? His name was Adolf. What was his real name? Adolf von Hitlerstein? I don't know. Fuck that Adolf guy. Adolf Alois Hitler? Fuck that guy, dude. Have him, have him paint a fucking watercolor of my cock. Where is he? Is he, can we get a hold of this guy? Top Gun. No. He was one of the extras in Top Gun. Was he? Adolf Hitler was yeah. an extra in Top Gun. And he also he was also a producer on Risky Business in 1983. An American teen sex comedy film directed by Paul Brickman starring Tom Cruise and Rebecca. Oh, my God, Rebecca De Mornay. I'm going to drop one. Yeah. She was hot, too. Like what does she White look like there. now? I don't know. She probably looks like Harvey Weinstein's balls. Um you know Sharon Stone? She's another one, dude, that looks like, oh, my God. And then she went all weird. Like ass. Yeah, she did some fucking weird shit, like, in the last few years. Yeah. I don't know. Turned into let's, a let's fucking see. cow. Yeah, she turned into a fucking slag. Uh, what are we Sharon doing? Stone. Sharon Stone's gooch. Sharon Stone's I'm typing cunt. in Sharon Stone's gooch really quick. I just want to see Stone's what her balls look like. Pussy. Um, she's still, pussy. I mean, I would still fuck Sharon Stone. Pussy. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Whoa! Never mind. Oh my god! I just never threw up in my fucking mind. mouth, never dude. Mind. Oh my god, dude! What? What is that? What is that, dude? That's her vagina, dude. They're not supposed to hang like that. Vaginas are not supposed to hang like that. Fuck, dude! I can't oh put that my anywhere. God. You can't, can't even put, put that, that on the internet, dude. No, that's, I can't put that. Okay, up. first of all, just to that's describe so for bad. everybody out there, it's a picture of Sharon Stone walking down a beach. In a bikini, and I fucking swear to God. Oh, which one is this? I am not going to. No, don't. Don't do it. I'm not going to be able to get a boner for a long <laughs> time now. Oh, is it this one? Oh, God. 
Oh, God nope, damn. it's not. Fucking it's worse than that one. Fucking sp- oh, there's one of her when she was fucking young. Spread ham. Oh, God. I'm going to throw up, man. Oh what am God. I looking for? Oh, God. Oh, my God. How much fucking... Why am I going deeper? That's like an Arby's Big Montana. Oh, my God. Just roast beef hanging in that. I mean, like, oh. if it wasn't... Dude, that's like a fucking cloth hammock just holding in, like, the beef, dude. Where's the beef? Sharon Stone's got the beef, I'm not baby. This up, oh, like, my God. Where's... Okay. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Like... Oh, wow. God. That's what happens when you don't oh, play the game. Oh, is this the one? That's what happens when you don't Her play the game. dude? <clears throat> Listen, here we go. once you go to Hollywood this? and you take the juice, you have to keep taking it. Yo. Yo. Dude, that guy's got that guy's got nicer tits than her. That dude, guy that, has... Not, dude, there's a man... I can't put that with up. ...with nicer tits than Sharon That looks Stone. so bad. Uh, <clears throat> nice fucking muffin top, honey. She got fucking tits like Spaniel's ears, guaranteed. That's enough to make you want to fucking hork right there. I, that's kind of oh Jesus Christ. <laughs> but when you look at pictures of her younger man, it's like it, it's like the it's like the stiffening all over again. That's like you don't even need Viagra. Dude, you just gotta go. I gotta go, I gotta go find something that's gonna make me fucking make me hoard. Yeah, dude. I I actually like feel like a who's gonna bit, make so. me who's gonna make me hoard. Uh, it's gonna go for the, the classic. It's should we end with the SS Enter guys? Dun 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 dun. dun, dun, dun. dun, dun. Dun, 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 starring B. A. Baracus as oh, here we go. Wait, no, wait, Mr. T as oh, Captain there Kirk. There we go. Jennifer Aniston did. Oh, there we go. She's got to be. Oh, oh wow, God. I can imagine sucking on those titties. Oh, fuck sucking yes. on those titties. That make me feel better. That would make me feel better, dude. That makes me feel so. Fucking much a, come on, give me some of them knockers. Let me tell you something. I'm a tit man. Okay. I'm the child of brother t- nature, t- fucking man. Child of brother nature, Mad Maximilian Squeedle, the man himself, the the, the the fucking legend, dude, right here. Yeah. Okay, I'm a tit man, dude. I'm all about the titties. Let me see them Jennifer Aniston titties, dude. Jennifer Aniston's another one of that. I'm not saying she fucking eats kids. I was throwing that up there. I got or I gotta drinks blood. That. Oh, but how does she look so goddamn good? I don't know. I heard she sleeps. I don't know. A oh, lot. I heard she sleeps like 14 a hours lot. a day. I'm sure that's hot. Dude, that's super hot. Dude, so many chances because to just I fucking, fucking nut on her face. I know. I was thinking the same thing. I was just going to say. We're going to cancel at you. At the same time. Time to get canceled. No, because she knows you're going to do it. Yeah, she loves it. Yeah, She's it's like, consensual. Yeah. We're not oh, talking about yeah. sneaking in there and just nutting on her. Oh, yeah. Billy. She wants you to do that, dude. Yeah, she dude, wants, she your wants semen. it on her Listen, face. Listen, if you're not vaccinated, she wants you. Contact Sharon Stone. She wants your cum. Okay? No, not, not, not what? Sharon Stone. Allegedly. We want a Jennifer Aniston, Don't right? Don't do that, actually. Don't start sending your semen in the mail to people. That's weird. <clears throat> I've never done that myself. She uh, wants uh, to uh, fuck uh. me. She wants my dick in and around her mouth. That would be great. <clears throat> Another one who's super hot. What's that redhead's name? Oh, that was uh, uh, what, Emma Stone. Emma Stone. Yeah, she's starting to. Uh, wait, she's starting she's... to look kind of fucking weird. Well, that's because the fucking the fucking Hollywood dope, brother. They, yeah, once the dope. You, I just told you, once you take you up, the bro. juice, you have to keep taking the it. The juice fucks you up. The, the juice. I mean, she's the super juice. hot. juice. Let's put it this way. She's super hot, but that last movie she did, look at these. Look at this. Whoa, whoa. Mm. This is what? This is going to be a titty? Oh, yeah. Are, we doing, a t- are we doing fair? titty reviews now? I don't care. I suck those dirty little ginger titties. Ha um. <laughs> ha! Yeah. Uh, there's no shame in my game. <clears throat> there is no shame in my game, brother. No. I would, I'll tell you what, why can't it be that way? Like, hey, we want to join Hollywood. Oh, well, you got to suck Emma Stone's titties. Oh, awesome. God. That yes. would be horrible. Yes. Find this picture. Look at this shit. Oh, what? Hold on. Emma Stone. Wow. Wow. When? That can't really be her. That's got to be a Photoshop picture. Is this picture. new? Is it current? Yeah, it's a Photoshop picture. That's Photoshopped. Where? Yeah. <clears throat> it's a picture of Emma Stone. You can see through the shirt. Oh. Um, I can't. I can't put that up. No, <laughs> we can't put that up. We get taken down for that. You can definitely see nip there. Yeah. Um, you can see the nips. Jen. Okay. It's yeah, not she's Jennifer. trying to get fucking. Emma ugly. Stone's fucking dirty nips. She's starting to get that weird look. She's got that. I'm a dirty ginger, and I will fucking do stuff with my mouth that will shock and amaze you. No. And yeah, I think she would. I truly do. Another one I think would do that. Uh, another Hollywood actress, who I truly believe, yeah, is is a, is a master of disaster. 
Oh, whoa, dude, contain yourself, brother. What are you standing uh-huh. over there? What do you got over there, bro? What's going on over there? Pinch my fucking balls in my underwear on accident, trying to move my ass. On accident, yeah. yeah. We're just talking about Emma Stone's purpose, boobs. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, of course, he just pinched his balls. Yeah, yep. ladies and gentlemen, he was attaching his fucking cock and ball tug. It's just basically, it's basically a 25-ton, a ton, 25-ton. It's 25-ton weight. That, that goes on uh, your nuts. Yeah, it's, uh, he's got a cock and ball harness. He puts on whenever he's about to get busy with his dick. Yeah. Um, I'm just kidding, dude. That would be really... Our actually, dad had taught us not to be ashamed of our dicks, yep. especially since they're such good size and all. Wow, you didn't play that twice or anything. <laughs> I've, played, I've played a lot of shit twice, bro. He's played a lot of shit twice, everybody. I don't give a shit. I you can don't suck my balls and eat my ass. I'm all right, going so home. Let's go over here. Let's check this out. What do we have Are here? we still going? Are we? We're just going to keep going. I mean, we're we got like, going. we're at 56 minutes. Hell yeah. Dude, we should wrap this up like a fucking. Really? We like should a, wrap like it a, up like a fucking. Like a, like a, like a sailor's cock at, at a fucking, at a Singapore fucking slingery. Yeah. Oh God. Cat again. I don't, actually, I don't think that uh, sailors wrap their dicks. What's up, buddy? They went to the. Uh... What's up, homie? Okay. Basil in the house. Coming down for the review. All right, guys. I just want to wrap this one up today. It's been real. Yeah. It's been it's real, been real. Weird, weird one. Um, this one will not be uploaded to our servers. To what servers? To the podcast? Yeah. Just going on YouTube? Yeah, we're just going to put this one on Spootube. Just as a test. Uh, as a test. But test tomorrow, video. tomorrow we will be filming a full live stream. Live and stream I'm going to have some live. amazing... I've got live. some Probably amazing... Amazing. Still. It will be pre-recorded. Yeah. Uh, just in case we drop any end towns or, yeah. any, or, or any S-bombs. Yeah. Uh, in case anyone's wondering what those are, it's uh, and that's it right there. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that too. Sorry. What about? Yeah. Okay, that's enough of that. Yeah. It, it just gets annoying. You might as well just say it after that. <laughs> yeah, right? It's like, all right, just fuck, yeah, fuck it. it. Keep, stop hitting the goddamn word. Just say the Easy goddamn Dr. word. Faggot. Paging. Dr. Faggot. He's over there. All right, everybody. Don't forget to tune in to our podcast. This is Not Funny Live. I'm Mad Maximilian. That's Duggar Von Haas. Dr. And this Gus, isn't the live. The this is not live. But it is. But it's not funny. It's live now. And it is funny. And it is funny. But, so, uh, so the name is kind of an oxymoron. Yeah, it is kind of an oxymoron because you're watching Not Funny Live. But we're not live and we're not funny. I mean, wait, we are funny. Sorry. Wait, what? Oh, shit.